Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today, no danky. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a video on my five time saving tips for weekdays. If you have, stop it. No. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a special video for Vlogtober and that is my five time saving tips for weekdays. If you are a working mom or have a child in school then I know that you know the struggle of finding outfits, matching outfits and all of that. So my number one tip will be pre-planned outfits the night before the weekday starts. So on Sunday nights pre-plan every outfit for the week. A lot of the clothes that she'll be having on this week are going to be new because it is finally fall. So I have everything laid out and I'll show you exactly how I go through the process. So I go through her closet, figure out what, what the weather is going to be for the week. And then I pull out everything that I know I want her to wear. definitely have to be to get your kids in a routine as well as yourself you have to get everything in order and get your system down packed prior to tip number you know, three getting up. will so, be to pre-plan lunches as well make a weekly menu of options for your child to choose from based on the things that you know you have in the house so on sunday nights i'll go through the house figure out the different snacks drinks and meals that i have for her saving tip number four would definitely be have alarms set or if not alarms timers give yourself a certain amount of time to do certain tasks like for myself I get up at six o'clock um I get up at six o'clock I go downstairs I make a coffee or tea for myself as well as finish what last minute items I need to finish for her lunch and then I'll get her toothbrush set up breakfast set up and all of that, I get her book bag packed in by the door and warm up the car because it's getting cold here. Then uh, by 6.20, I am all finished with everything and it's time for me to come up, get London, get London and Joe woke and ready for the day. Get them dressed and get her tooth brushed and her face washed and everything like that. So excuse the extreme damage of my phone, but I wanted to show you how my lawns are set up. So tip would definitely be to have everything ready before you wake your child up like I was saying I like to get everything ready so before I even wake London up her breakfast is made her toothbrush already has toothpaste on it and as well as um, her book bag all of that is packed so when she wakes up once I wake her up all she has to do is get dressed brush her teeth wash her face and we, that's it 
Everything else is already ready. So when she comes down, she can eat if she's eating breakfast at home. Or she can, you know, do all of that. All she does to do is put her shoes on and we can go. Do her hair the night before. Like if with London, as you see, I gave you some tips. If I don't do a hairstyle that um, I know can last quite a few days, then I'll do her hair the night before. Most of the times I put her hair in styles that can last the whole week. So I'll do her hair Sunday night and then that hairstyle is for the week and then Saturday, I'll do her hair again. I will like, take her hair down, wash it, let it breathe a little bit. Sunday night, do it again. Because it, it's a huge time uh, time consumer to have to deal with her hair the morning before. If your child doesn't have as long of hair or as hard to manage hair, then it's definitely not as big of a deal. But by her hair being so thick and curly, it is definitely a time consumer to try to do her hair that is it for the my day of. Time saving tips for the weekday. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please give it a thumbs up and I hope you subscribe so you can continue to see all of our different videos throughout vlogtober as i said in my announcement october is my birthday month so i have quite a few special videos planned for you guys and i would love it if you could share those moments with me and don't forget to leave your time saving tips down below to help out other mothers with different ideas that you have mastered as well and i'll see you in the next one